What's up, YouTubers? This is your boy Voodoo 306 coming to you live, and today I'm going to be doing a WWE 2K18 review. And sorry about the screen being up and down like this. I'm recording from my cell phone. I don't feel like getting out my um, webcams and doing anything crazy. So, yeah, just bear with me, guys. This is the WWE 2K18 game right here. Hope, I'm hoping y'all can see it straight and it's not backwards for you guys. I'm sure it's not. But for my side, Seth Rollins looks straight, but this looks backwards. To, yeah. But anyways, I got my pros and my cons on here. I wanted the Nuff Edition, but turns out I ended up ordering the regular version for Kurt Angle. I thought I ordered the Nuff Edition, so it pissed me off when I first got it. But I did pre-order it, so I can get it, play it four days before everybody else. Blah, blah, blah. And I've been playing it ever since. Now, I'm, I'm going to start with the cons. This, I'm not, this is a completely raw video, alright? I'm going to start with the cons. The things I don't like about this game is there's too many glitches in the game. If you don't know what I'm talking about, play the game for yourself and see what I'm talking about. There's tons of other YouTubers talking about the um, glitch in the game. There's tons of different glitches, like when you're backstage, you do a certain move to your opponents, your opponents are glitching to the floor, or they're glitching to the cars or something in the back or you glitched in the ring like you can be running out of your opponent some for some odd reason you'd be outside the ring and you glitch back in the ring and then you'd be going top rope you try to jump in your opponent and you glitch into the floor of the ring you glitch into the rope to get ready to do a move or you would go to pin your opponent you know how people get in the ring and break up the pin yeah but sometimes they get glitched into the ropes where they can't help out their partner things like that I'm hoping I'm not talking too fast for you guys. If so, put the video in slow. Because I know I do talk fast. I'm trying to knock this video out the way. I do got things to do after this. So yeah, my number one con about this is the glitches. Number two that I like about this game is the loading screen. The screen takes a while to load. It's like, I think I'm playing GTA when it comes to the loading screen. Uh, what else? Yeah, to talk about the glitches, to talk about the loading screen. Both of them sucks. There's a little bit extra things you can do, like... I mean, like, WWE 2K17, the last game that came out, you were able to go backstage, but now you can go backstage in this game, but you can go a little bit farther in the game. But it's not that much extra you can do backstage. It's like... I think it's like a complete replica of 2k17 I like 2k17 I like 2k18 don't get me wrong I'm not trying to bash the game bash the 2k but I'm not really too impressed I am impressed with the um way the characters look this year they look more realistic because they talking about 2k17 was supposed to look realistic but y'all see how it looks it don't look that realistic as they did on the trailer and this morning I thought I had to return my game system. I mean, I mean not my, my not my game system. My um the 2K18 game because the reason why I said I need to return it is because when I tried loading it, it would not go past the start menu screen. I kept saying, man, something must be wrong with Wi-Fi or something must, must, must be wrong must be wrong with the server. Trying to find come to find out it was just Xbox. I had to reset everything. But yeah, I've had my ups and downs about the game. I've only had for of course since October, I think that's when it was released. And yeah. Okay. Some of some of my hair. But anyways, my pros about the game, the characters look they do look realistic. And on this game you could download characters that like for example Bobby Lashley, um, Goldberg, Mickey James, people like that. They even got Dash XP in the game, guys. The YouTuber Dash XP. I know that these are created characters by people. You can download them. I got a few of them downloaded. I'm, I was currently playing it before I um, decided to jump on this video. I turned the TV off because I ain't trying to get copyrighted. Hope this ain't getting copyrighted too because YouTube copyrights for everything nowadays. I haven't been making videos in a while because I've been focusing on working, cutting hair, 
get my life together. That's why I've been making videos, guys. So, a rating of this game out of one to five stars. I get about three and a half stars. It's okay, you know. It's alright. It's just certain things in the game that make you think, like, why is this in the game, or why the game doing this? Cause I can't deal with these glitches, guys. No. I know it's not a video that you guys really probably care about, but for the ones who do care about the new about that game, good kudos. And I also got Gears of War the um, Unlimited Edition or whatever it's called. I just bought that game probably like a few weeks ago. I know it's been out for some time. Hold on, guys. Let me look it up real quick. Yeah, it's this the um, ultimate edition. My bad. I know it's a pretty old game. It came out back in 2015. But I'm just now getting into the game because I was never really a Gears of War fan or Battlefield fan, but now I'm slowly getting into it. But yeah, guys. Um, hope you guys like this video. Make sure you comment, subscribe, and rate. And I'll see you guys later. Oh yeah, by the way, Happy New Year! It's 2018, guys. Woo! I know it's still 2017, but later on tonight, it's going to be 2018. So I don't, I won't see you guys until next year, which is a couple hours. Deuce!